Well, mixed news for pharmaceutical companies today, focusing on the weight loss drug race. Let's bring in Anjali Kamlani, who's been following the details. Anjali, one of those names you're tracking, Pfizer, those shares hitting a new low today. That's right. Uh, really, what we got out of Pfizer was expected news in the sense that their pill for weight loss or type 2 diabetes in that same category of the drugs, the GLP-1 class, they decided to pick a, a, one of their candidates that is a twice daily pill rather than the once daily, which was what investors and those watching the space closely had expected. So because of that, we're seeing that hit to Pfizer stock. Um, it is one of the uh, one of three that are currently in competition for getting to the market. We know that Nova Nordisk already has its market contender uh, on the market for type two approved. Meanwhile, Eli Lilly, specifically with one pill option uh, gearing towards obesity, but other uh, candidates as well and other products as well in the market geared towards type two. It's really mixed when you talk about that space just because of the difference between what indications they are already approved for. But suffice it to say that there are three competitors in the space for that pills, for the pills. Uh, we got a, a note from a JPM analyst uh, talking about how much of a hit this is for Pfizer, noting quote, this represents a clear setback to the program in our view with this specific candidate expected to be the more competitive of the two assets that uh, uh, Pfizer had. They initially had that once daily. So now with this twice daily, they are still working through the phase two program for it. Uh, Eli Lilly is a little bit ahead with some uh, news out last week on positive indications from its pill. And meanwhile, Pfizer is also going to be working on trying to get this twice daily pill into a once daily format. So, you know, still a lot of stuff in the works. They're, they're still figuring out the dosing and the like. So a lot there to kind of look at. Yeah, a lot of focus on those two companies moving forward. Anjali Kamlani, thanks so much for that.